life, living a fiercely empowered, take 311. Today's topic, you, their lives are precious. I'm here by the new school because I feel so very fortunate that my life in this moment in time is attracting these phenomenal films that are striking my core and moving my heart in accordance with my desires of actualizing the life of my dreams. Tearing down every construct of disbelief and roadblocks I put in the way. Point in case, any day now. Travis Fine's premier direct directorial debut, and he blows it out of the water. And of course, the actors Alan Cumming, Garrett Delahunt, Isaac Levey, and Francis Fisher really helped by giving Oscar-level performances that ripped my heart out and made the issues at hand up close and personal. And thanks to the ignorance, prejudices, and preconceived notions of our society, this film does not have a happy ending. Too many lives of our youth are lost to our own fears and negative experiences. Aaron Anson says that there are no winners in this religious, religion-driven massacre of human life, and he's an inspirational self-help speaker and author of Mind Your Own Life, The Journey Back to Love. And I want to leave you with this thought. Whatever they grow up to be, they are still our children, and the most important of all the things we can give to them is unconditional love. Not a love that depends on anything at all except that they are our children. Rosalind Dickerson, Life, Living a Fiercely Empowered.